Good day, viewers. Here I come back to another class in mathematics when we're talking about the standard form. Today, we're going to be looking at multiplication and division joint cases. When we have multiplication and division joined together, how do we go about it? But before we dive into it, if you have not subscribed to this channel, kindly do so and click the notification bell for my subsequent list. Now, example one. Without using tables or calculator, simplify. I've told you the meaning of without using table and calculator in our previous classes. Now, we are going to move away this point to the back of the digits. As, as, so moving this one away, we have 6 multiplied by 10 is power. You are moving backward. If you are moving backward, is the power, that's the power of 10 is going to be negative. And you are moving once, minus 1 times 32 times 1, 2, 3. We have 4 times 10 is power. You are moving backward 3 times, minus 3, divided by move backward as once 12 times 10 is power minus 1 then times 1 2 3 8 times 10 is power minus 3 times 1 2 16 times 10 is power minus 2 here 10 is power minus 1 cancel 10 is power minus 1 10 is power minus 3 cancel 10 is power minus 3 so we have c is here 1 c is here 2 all together, 2 here 1, 2 goes here, we have 16, 8 here 1, 8 here 2. So we are going to have, what we have here is 2. Okay, 4 here 1, 4 here 4. So we have 2 divided by, what do we have here? 4. Multiplied by 10 is power minus 2. 2 here 1, 2 here 2. So I'm going to have 1 divided by 2 times 10 by minus 2. This can be written as 1 over 2 times... When I take this 1 to this 1, 1 over 2, it's going to be equal to multiply by, let's say this is a division sign, 10 is by minus 2. So there must be something here which is 1 as well. So if you multiply 1 times 1, we'll be able to go back to this 1. Then 2 times 10 to the minus 2, we go back to this one. So we now have 1 divided by 2 is 0 0.5, multiplied by this 10, 10 to the minus 10, 10, this is 10. 1 over in indices changes to minus. Meaning minus in indices changes to 1 over. So 1 over in indices will change back to minus. Then we now have minus 2. So we have 0 0.5 times 10 to the power, minus as minus plus, that is 2. Now, but our point must be at back of the first digit number, which is non-zero, so and this is zero, we take this one this way, so we have 5 times 10 is power, we are moving backward, once minus 1, times 10 is power 2, so we have 5 times 10 is power minus 1, plus 2, that is 5 times 10 is power, minus 1 plus 2, we have what? 1. So this is a standard form, or you say 5.0, times 10 is power 1 is still the same thing. Example 2, evaluate 2.25 times 10 is power minus 2 divided by 0 0.225 times 10 is power minus 3 multiplied by 22.5 times 10 is power 2. Now, let us interpret this. 2.25 times 10 is power minus 2 divided by 0 0.225 times 10 is power minus 3, then times 22.5 times 10 is power 2. See, this one has a denominator, we can say over 1 here. So let us now work by removing this decimal point, 1, 2, I'm moving backward, 2, 2, 5 times 10 is power, I'm moving backward, that is minus 2, then times 10 is power minus 2 divided by move this one 1, 2, 3. That is 2, 2, 5 times 10 is power minus 3 times 10 is power minus 3 times move this one 1, 2, 2, 5 times 10 is power minus 1 and times 10 is power 2 over 1. 
Thanks for minus three. Okay. Okay. Minus three. There's no thanks for minus three here. But this can do this. So pick one of these things here. Then is for minus two. Minus two. Divided by determinant. Then is for minus three. Minus three. Then times two, two, five. Times pick one thing. Then is for minus one plus two. So we have 10 is power minus 2 minus 2, we have minus 4 over 10 is power minus 3 minus 3, we have minus 6. So times 2, 2, 5 times 10 is power minus 1 plus 2, we have 1. So over 1. So this can multiply each other. So when they multiply each other, we are going to have 2, 2, 5, 2, 2, 5 times 10 is power minus 4 times 10 is power 1 divided by 10 is power minus 6. So we have 2, 2, 5 times, take this together, 10 is power minus 4 plus 1 divided by 10 is power minus 6. So 2, 2, 5 times 10 is power minus 4 plus 1 minus 3 over 10 is power minus 6. Now, I have to put decimal points at the back of the first digit. So I have 1, 2. So we have 2.25 times pick that times 10 is for power. I'm moving forward. That is 2. Then times 10 is power minus 3 divided by 10 is power minus 6. So we have 2.25 times 10 is power 2 minus 3. We have minus 1 divided by 10 is power minus 6. So this can be taken together. So here, here we have 2.25 times pick one of these 10, 10 is to the power minus one. This division changes to minus, minus, minus six. So we have 2.25 times 10 is to the power minus one. Minus is minus plus six. So 2.25 times 10 is to the power minus one plus six, that is five. So that is the final answer in working uh, the combination of multiplication and division. Example three, simplify without using calculator or tables. These values correct to two decimal places. We have, as, we, as I said earlier on, we move this point away totally. One, two, three, four. So I have one, two, five, times 10 is 5, you are moving backward, negative, minus 4, you move 4 times, times 1, 2, 3, 6, 2, 5, times 10 is power minus 3, divided by 1, 2, 3, 75, times 10 is power minus 3, times 1, 2, 25, times 10 is power minus 2. From here, this can cancel this. So we are going to have 1, 2, 5 times 6, 2, 5 times 10 is power minus 4 divided by 75 times 25 times 10 is power minus 2. 25 year 1, 25 year 25. 5 year 1, 5 year 5. 5 year 7, we have 1. In 25, we have 15. 5 year 5 year 3. So we have. 125 multiplied by 10 is power minus 4 divided by 3 times 10 is power minus 2. So when you divide this one, we are going to have 125 divided by 3 times 10 is power minus 4 divided by 10 is power minus 2. So when you divide this one, we have 41.667 times pick one of these 10, 10 is power minus 4. This divide changes to minus, then minus 2. So we have 41.667 times 10 is power minus 4. Minus is minus plus 2. So we have 41.667 times 10 is power minus 4 plus 2. We have minus 2. So you move this point to the back of the first digit number. So we have 4.1667 times 10 is power. Since you are moving forward, that is 1. Positive. Times 10 is power minus 2. 
So we have 4.16667 times 310. That is for 1 minus 2. That is 4.1667 times 10 is for minus 1. So this is how to work with joint cases. When we're talking about multiplication and division, joint cases of standard form. It's an interesting topic, but we need to be very careful. If you are a new member on this channel, and this class is very interesting to you, kindly subscribe. Click the red subscribe weight and click the notification bell for my subsequent classes. And don't forget to share to other learners for them to also benefit. Thank you very much. We meet in the next class. We'll be talking about the square roots in standard form.